about to kick off our 92nd consecutive season. Wow, um, it's going to be awesome. Being that we started here in 1926, we're going to give them four games. So we got two games on the 28th at the United Center, and then on the 29th, we're going to play at Allstate. We got another two games. So four games in two days. That's pretty special. Now, Buckets and Dragon, a lot of people, the misconception at least, when I was a kid growing up watching Globetrotters, I was like, man, these guys are magicians with the basketball. And you are, but your background is also one of simply being really good at the sport as well. That's correct. Yeah, yeah definitely. Uh, I played professionally as well. So most importantly, we went to college, and everybody got some type of accolade too. So yeah, cool. so we all play college yeah. ball. Um, basketball was a passion for us. You get to the Globetrotters, you're a little bit nervous because you don't know any of this stuff, yeah, and yeah. then you have to figure it out. You kind of get thrown in the fire, but you work hard. The veterans take you under their wings. Yeah. yeah. So like, what's the criteria? I mean, because you can be a gifted basketball player, but that doesn't mean you can perform like the Globetrotters, right? For yeah. sure, our scouts do a good job of finding guys and girls um, who played. Uh, college ball or professionally somewhere else and they're looking for three criteria they're looking for great basketball players they're looking for great athletes and they're looking for a certain personality because it transcends the court we do a lot of community outreach all over the place our anti-bullying character awesome. education hospital visits well clearly there's no height requirement because you guys have somebody who just signed who is four foot five yes Jamani Swanson and yeah. many have dubbed him the mini Michael Jordan I mean this is yeah cool, you, right? you know he's well, out of this world right yeah there he is he's <laughs> yeah. out of this world he's phenomenal um, uh, contrary to popular belief, he can shoot the ball, dribble the ball, pass the ball. He's, to shoot that and he's fast, fast too. And he's fast. fast. And he's, I mean, he's a, a little, a little athlete. Like he, he can do so much, and he brings so much to the table. He's always excited and happy, and he meets the criteria. That's super cool. So December 28th, you guys will be here at United Center. Can you tell everybody why they should go check you guys out? Besides um, the obvious. Well, the wholesome family entertainment for sure. It's the holidays. The Globetrotters are one of those entertainment entities where the whole family's on the same page. You got the grandkids, the parents, and the grandparents all on the same page. That's tough to do these days in this in this generation to have three generations on the same page but also lots of high-flying dunks, um, amazing dribbling, uh, trick shots. We set 17 Guinness World Records, and um, we got a lot to offer, you know. And then we added the flying globies, too. They're going to be jumping off trampolines, yeah. doing these crazy flips, you know. So it's going to be amazing. So you kick it off United Center, doubleheader at Allstate Arena. All right, so I have a confession. Okay. So I played a lot of basketball, right? You know, Danielle <sighs> knows I was a star back in the day. She knows I'm a big deal. Okay, we try to keep okay. that on the low. I'm just All right. kidding. But I don't know how, and I've never learned how, to spin a basketball on my finger. And that's like the basic basketball one-on-one thing. One -on -one you thing. wanna, I'll hook you up. Can you, you teach know, me how to do sure. it? I'll teach you how to do it. So we got to switch sides. Let's switch right. sides. He's producing okay. now, too. Globe so, Trotters took over the studio. You got to a little bit. So you always want it on your index finger, not your traffic finger. <laughs> not the traffic finger. Okay, yeah, I got not you. Traffic it's finger. Chicago. You see the traffic finger a lot. Yeah, so index, but just look at the camera. Don't even look at the ball. You got to look Ooh, like you know what you're doing. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. <laughs> All right, you guys got one more trick for us, right? Cause he's yeah. Here we go. We got a few pass. Just ball. That's making me look bad. I could never do any of this stuff. Oh, hey. You ever make mistakes? Oh, yeah, but you won't be able to tell. No, you won't be able to tell. Yeah, I messed up. You know? Now, here, we just take this thing around here. I don't know how much time we got. You got a little bit. We'll give you about 30 more, 20 more seconds. I won't make you too much. It's coming to him now. You got 20 more seconds? Okay, hold on. Watch out. Ooh, I do it with the booty. Yeah, right there. Hey. It is. There we go, baby. Uh oh. Ooh. Buckets. Don't get those hurt them. Skills. Oh Don't hurt them, buckets. God, look at those skills. Sometimes you gotta. All right, that's the grand finale <laughs> right there. Yeah. Dragon Taylor, I appreciate it, thank my you, friend. Thank you, man. Thank you. Buckets Blakes. Thank you, man. Killing it. If you guys yeah. don't want to be entertained or you really want to be entertained, check these guys out right here. Tickets are available for the Harlem Globetrotters on December 28th at the United Center and 29th at the Allstate Arena. They're there. You got to check them out. Log on to HarlemGlobetrotters.com for ticket information.